um, so I have the engines here, but, um, I want to get, like, a closer look at them. Yeah. Yeah, you can see this is higher than this one. <laughs> but yeah, um, hmm. let's look at this one first. Um, so, so you have four zero zero three DC to AC. Um, and got the transition and then the fuel tank and the top got the antenna and then <laughs> then has the sun visors which actually move so which is big then you got the horn then you got the exhaust I think yeah I've seen a lot of the one I've seen a lot um of dash nines with where it has fire coming out of it. And um back Pretty much the same on this side too. <laughs> um, yeah. That truck is a little bit bigger than the train. <laughs> I mean, no. These two are an HO scale, so they're a little bit bigger. Now let's look at the 1009. So that was 4003. Hmm. Yeah, right there. Says FD seventy ACE, and um, yeah, I don't really like how the horn is on this one because when you're trying to grab it, you're trying. I'm more in. I'm trying not to break it off because like it sticks up. You can see the way it is, but for the other one, it's like a little bit lower, so I can grab it. Easily, so yeah. it's got the emergency shut off. Got the thing to see where the fuel is. I think that's the emergency cut off. Yeah, um, yeah, the top got two fans here. The I mean, now I'm trying to look for the bell. See if there's a bell on here. Usually it's on the driver's side. Yeah, this one also has the 
sun visors, but um, they're not movable. Yeah, I don't see no bell on here. Yeah, they're actually pretty heavy. Because usually real working engines aren't that heavy. Like 4003 here. It's like pretty light. Hey, yeah, see, there's the bell right there. Oh, it's right there. Hmm. Hmm. Unless on this one the bell's somewhere else. At least I think. Um. You got the horns. Um, I'm not really seeing a bell. I don't really know where the bell is on these types. Um, on this side. Um, there's the handbrake in there. No, <laughs> I thought it might be like right here somewhere, but it's not. Um, yeah, out of the three of them, well, two of them are the same, this one, I bought two of these in the same number, but out of all of them, I like this one the most, but <laughs> I'm gonna have to trim down the plow. A little because on camera it looks super far it looks far from the I don't know <laughs> but it definitely doesn't make it um around the track fully because it hits the, the plow um but yeah. So this is kind of like a review video. So yeah. Oh yeah. And where I'm sitting right now is where my train set used to be, but we took it down. So yeah. Um. So yeah. I'll. My ratings for this one. Is eight eight point five out of ten, and this one. Well, reason why I gave it eight point ten, because it's it's good. It looks good, but it's missing a bell, and also. Um. And also, it doesn't have movable sun visors. And this one, I'll give it 9 out of 10. Because, um, because everything's th there. Um, the, the bell is right there. It has movable sun visors. 
But the only thing that gives it a 9 is because the plow. It's too low. So, yeah. Um. But yeah. And right, there's the. Um. Handbrake there. Yeah. So, on this one, it's on the. On the right side, and, and on this one, it's on the. No, this one's on the left side, and this one's the right side. <laughs> um, but yeah. But yeah. Well, anyway, see all you in the next video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that bell. While you add it too, so you can get more, so you know when when I upload more videos on these. And yeah, see. Yeah. Right, uh, bye.